Should farmers give pigs more space? That question came before the U.S. Supreme Court this week in a battle between the state of California and the nation's top pork producers, with potentially huge implications for millions of pigs and a multi-billion dollar industry in a case that doesn't fall predictably along party lines. Today's conflict centers on a 2018 California law that bans pork sales from pigs kept in tightly confined spaces, even if those pigs are raised outside of California. Each year, according to animal rights activists, millions of pigs are raised in crates so small that they are unable to turn around for most of their lives. California wants them to have 24 square feet of room to roam. Those for the law, like Kitty Block, who is the CEO of the U.S. Humane Society, says tight spaces are inhumane. The majority of consumers around the country are saying enough is enough. And we just because these animals are food, it doesn't mean that they should be cruelly treated up until that point. These are not extreme ideas. This is really common sense measures. And it is well documented when you can find animals in close quarters, when they are stressed, when they are sick, disease spreads. But the pork industry is pushing back, arguing that the changes California wants won't just be more costly, but could set a dangerous precedent. At the hearing before the court on Tuesday, the justices across the ideological spectrum appeared torn. Michael Formica is the chief legal strategist at the National Pork Producers Council. Yeah, we, we feel pretty good coming out of it. Court seemed to appreciate um, the, the dilemma that's created. Uh, and this is a case about pig and pig farming. Um, but the principles involved apply across the board. You know, today it's California for, for our members. They're worried about in two years, um, you know, some the, the rules changing again, right? So New York goes from 24 square feet and says, well, no, you need to be at 26 square feet. And then California says, oh, you, you know what? You need to be at 30 square feet. But what if it's Texas, right? What if Texas comes up with something based on the morals of Texas or Florida comes up based on the morals of Florida? Um, you know, with, with the size of their economies, uh, we will we will not have 50 states anymore. We'll have four you know four huge states that control all economic activity across the country. The White House seems to agree. President Joe Biden's administration has already sided with pork producers, not California, arguing that states cannot ban products that pose no threat to public health on philosophical objections. A ruling is due by the end of June.